Mike Dunaway qualified to play in the 1976 Las Vegas Invitational. At that event, his club head speed was measured at 131 miles per hour, which set an unofficial world record at the time. He then began working with his mentor, Dr. Mike Austin. That was also the first year that the World Long Drive Championship was being held in conjunction with the PGA Championship. Once Austin and Dunaway began working together, they became like brothers and for over 20 years they had a lot of fun together. Dunaway called his mentor the most knowledgeable golf instructor in the world. What made Austin special as instructor was that he held a doctorate in kinesiology. Using that knowledge, the two of them worked together to try and create as biomechanically perfect a golf swing as possible. Many people consider Dunaway's swing to be Mike Austin's masterpiece. In an interview in 2014, Dunaway said, During that time, I was as good as anybody. There were six or seven guys that could win. I think I can drive the ball, ball for ball combining distance and accuracy, as well as anyone who has ever done it. And he was not alone in his assessment, Greg Norman said, he is the longest living human on earth. And legendary golf analyst Ken Venturi said, Dunaway swing combines power and accuracy with a driver better than anyone I have ever seen. Dunaway's true genius was promoting long drive. According to Art Selinger, LDA, Chief Executive Director, I give full credit to Mike for being a true pioneer in the promotion of long drive. His creation of the 350 Club, Long Drive Celebrity Pro AMS and worldwide appearances and events paved the way for many future long drivers' success. Three-time World Long Drive Champion Sean, the Beast, Fister added, Mike Dunaway made long driving cool. Dunaway loved publicity stunts and was the first to drive golf balls from the rooftops of the Caesars Palace and the Dunes Hotels. But his greatest stroke of marketing genius was for the cover of Golf Magazine when he stood on top of a pile of money and offered $10,000 to anyone that could drive a golf ball farther than him. The issue still holds the magazine's all-time record for the most issues sold at the newsstand. He was also on the cover of Golf Digest in August of 1985 and in November of 1987. By the way, although many people took Dunaway's challenge, nobody was able to beat him out of the $10,000. Ely Callaway considered Dunaway the best teacher on the Callaway staff. And as such, he was asked to be in on the ground floor of the developing and promoting Callaway's Big Bertha driver. Dunaway said, it was one of the most rewarding accomplishments of my career. The Big Bertha testing changed the game of golf. The LDA proudly presented him with their 2013 Lifetime Achievement Award in recognition of the tremendous contributions that he made to the sport. Unfortunately, less than a year later, complications arose from his lengthy battle with diabetes and he died on September 29, 2014 at the age of 59. Your Simple Golf Swing carries on the memory of Mike Dunaway and Mike Austin by teaching their method exactly as they taught it.